Dylan Dreyer talks about a bittersweet family outing while disclosing fresh information about her personal life. Dylan Dreyer talked candidly about a bittersweet experience she had while spending the weekend with her whole family. The Today Show star and her husband Brian Fira visited their old family home, which brought back many memories, with their three sons, Oliver, four, and Rusty, two, while the family was there to celebrate their niece's graduation, Dylan and Brian even staged their proposal, which Brian's sister unintentionally pursued. What a special weekend, she revealed. Greetings on your high school graduation, at Emma. Reading 5. We're so happy for you. It was heartbreaking because it was the last large celebration at the home that at Fishlands grew up in. We had to repeat our engagement ceremony because at NM Reading unintentionally crashed it when Bry and I got engaged on the front porch. Furthermore, none of Brian's childhood pals were married or had children when they last spent a night together at the property. Here we are. Hashtag Soblist. In 2011, Dylan accepted Brian's proposal, and a year later, they were married. In a Boston.com interview, Dylan recalled the engagement by saying, I knew when I saw there were two glasses of champagne and roses. She continued by saying that, to celebrate the good news, all of their relatives and friends were waiting for them inside the house. Over the years, Dylan has talked about some of his favorite moments from their wedding day in Boston, including one that happened on the dance floor. The DJ asked Brian what song to play last at the end of our wedding. The woman told People, Brian said, Viva La Vida, by Coldplay, at random. Although the song had nothing to do with us, it was flawless. He simply twirled me around the dance floor while I was tying up my long dress. It was unadulterated bliss, love, and joy. We are now fully engrossed in the final seconds of our ideal day.